हेलो फ्रेंड्स गुड मॉर्निंग गुड आफ्टरनून गुड इवनिंग सो दिस इज अबाउट थापर यूनिवर्सिटी और थापर इंस्टीट्यूट ऑफ इंजीनियरिंग एंड टेक्नोलॉजी एंड आई एम गोइंग टू टॉक अबाउट द कोर्सेज सीट मैट्रिक्स एंड द जेई मेंस कट ऑफ सो बिफोर दैट आई एम आल्सो गोइंग टू टॉक अबाउट द काउंसलिंग प्रोसेस राइट सो यू कैन सी दिस इज द ऑफिशियल रिलीज फ्रॉम द कॉलेज ऑन सेवेंथ मे ट्वेंटी एंड दिस टॉक्स अबाउट द फर्स्ट राउंड ऑफ काउंसलिंग विल बी हेल्ड ऑन फोर्टींथ ऑफ मे राइट so for all the students who have applied uh, for admission through j means the merit list will be declared on 14th may and the candidates would have applied already till 8th may 2024 which was the last day so uh, your first round of counseling will be held online right so candidates are not required to visit the campus so 14th may the first round of counseling is happen is going to happen online only candidates will be able to check their branch allocation status on the online portal on the day of counseling so that is the first round of counseling and talking about the selected candidates they will be required to pay the fees by 20th of may so you are only given one week's time less than one week time six day to pay the fees and application form which was closed on 8th of may from 9th onwards it will be closed till 15 so 9th to 15th nobody can apply it will be made available for new application from 16th may onwards for the subsequent round of counseling with the application fee of rupees 2000 so somebody who wants to apply fresh they can do after 16th may 2024 with the application fees of rupees 2000 and during the counseling the branch allocation will be as per the merit category by seat availability and branch preference order should be filled in the application form and the candidates will are advised to recheck all the details especially about the branch preference and before submitting this so that was the guideline and candidates will be offered branch provisionally and if they fulfill all the criteria which is mentioned in their brochure then the admission is confirmed so now let me come to the main topic of this which is the cut off rights and before that we should know the total amount of seats which are available for this year so this is 24 25 seat matrix and you can see the branch and the branch code which is very important biomedical engineering 30 seats biotechnology 90 seats and chemical engineering ce is the code and 60 seats civil engineering ci is the code 60 seats civil engineering with computer application 60 seats are also there and computer engineering is coe with 960 the highest number of seats is with computer engineering computer science engineering in the patiala campus copc is 366 and then computer science engineering in the dera bassi campus cose is around 120 seats and then there is another branch for computer specialization which is called computer science and business system cobs which also has got 60 seats so in this sheet itself you can see four or five branches are related with computer science engineering right now moving to the next which is electrical engineering ele 90 seats are there and then electrical and computer engineering ec is the code 120 seats are there and electronics and computer engineering ece is the code to 240 is the seats total and electronics and computer combination is also there which is enc and 360 seats are there then there is a new branch which is electronics engineering and specialization in vlsi design and technology evd is the code 90 seats and electronics which is instrumentation and control engineering eic 90 seats are there then you do have mechanical engineering mee mechatronics which is mec 60 seats and robotics and artificial intelligence which is rai and 90 seats and artificial intelligence and machine learning last two are the new courses aiml 120 seats so last two courses are uh, due for aict approval so one it's up, one is approved the total number of seats are 3200 so last year the total number of seats were 2500 so you can see clearly that 700 more seats are added which is a sort of good news and uh, there are chances of very high now 50% of these seats are through j means rest 53% is through 10 plus 2 uh, criteria right so total j means seats is around 
100 seats right so which you can take which is a good opportunity for students to get a uh, you know good branch now based on the last year's uh, cutoff right what are the branches available and at what cutoffs and there are some you know uh, categories which are mentioned here so all the columns have the category so first is the category called geno g e n o which is general from outside of punjab then there is a category called g e n p which is general from punjab so g e means uh, g starting is general s c o is scheduled caste from outside punjab s c s t is basically scheduled caste scheduled tribe p h o is basically physically handicapped which is from outside punjab and p h p is the physically handicapped which is from punjab STO is the scheduled tribe from outside Punjab and S and BC BC is for backward class from Punjab so those are the category codes and the course codes i have already mentioned and it is also mentioned in the bottom of the sheet you can check that so you have seen the you know COBS right which is computer science and business system general category cutoff is 96 percentile 96.66 SC uh, open category for uh, outside Punjab is like uh, eighty point four seven, and ST outside Punjab is around fifty six percentile. COE, which is uh, now the next branch which you can see here, is computer engineering, and ninety four point four seven is the uh, percentile cutoff for general category, and sixty uh, six for SC and ST. It was still open. COPC, which is the next branch, CO means computer science with Patiala campus, CSC with Patiala campus, 98 point. The branch in highest demand is 98.06 for general category. And SC, it is around 89 percentile. ST, it is around 65 percentile. Same branch which is available in Derabasi campus, it is called COSE and it will be lower cutoff. You can see here the cutoff is only. 94.87 percentile so 4 percentile lesser in Derabasi campus for general and 81 percentile for SC students and ST it was still available so those were computer branches further you can see EC, e, e, EC and ENC branches which are related with electronics and uh, uh, electronics and communication and electronics with computers right so and the one EEC is basically electrical with computer. So the cutoff was 91.72 for general category outside Punjab. EEC was 92.58 and ENC was 93.33. So quite uh, you know decent uh, opportunity for student there from outside Punjab. Now I will start with the people from Punjab. So Punjab uh, people will have the codes GNP and SCST and BC those are for Punjab last three columns so COBS branch for uh, general category from Punjab which is 95 percentile same you know COE branch will be 89 percentile for general COPC in Patiala campus 97 and COSE in Derabasi campus 89 percentile and EC is even available at 80, 80, 80 percentile and uh, uh, EEC which is electrical and computer at 84 percentile and ENC which is the last one which is uh, 84.6 percentile which is uh, in le electronics and computer branch. So those are the cutoff for last year and uh, if you see uh, you know BC which is the backward class again the cut cutoffs are between 87 to 64 percentile but rest of the SCST cutoffs you know most of the branches are still vacant after even the uh, first round counseling. So that is the overall for all the categories from Punjab and outside Punjab. Thanks for watching and please do subscribe channel to get similar updates. Take care and bye.